the Lonesome Glory Hurdle is next. We're in Brooklyn for this one. Not firm going for this two and a half mile hurdle. And it was a dead heat last year between Darren Thompson and Leon Van Rinsburg's horse. So let's see what happens this time. Aerial along for Darren Thompson at the top. Code Black or Graham Clitterbuck. Max. Alex Cherry. No Lecker Marcus. Or Martin Needham. Or a Fairer for Matt Cooper. Bahamian Branch. Leon Van Rinsburg. Be a dancer, David Hooley. Keep alive, Leon Van Rinsburg. You shindy win. Alex Cherry and Yossamite for Craig Beckwith. So a lot of returners in this again, as you'd expect. And away they go with the majority of the races this week being maidens. There's not really that many places that the previous winners can go. So I'm surprised these races over in America are quite, haven't had bigger fields. The next one has got a massive field though as they get over the first. And you can see these hurdles look exactly the same as the fences do. And it's Aura Fera who's in the lead. I am reliably informed by those that know that it is a hurdle despite the size of these fences <laughs> and the horse's hurdle rating and handicap mark is what's being used in these races and it's a hurdle rating that will be affected by the result despite the fact that you may be looking at this race thinking those are fences they're jumping over not hurdles anyway Aura Fera is blazing the trail newcomer from Matt Cooper his baptism of fire this week this first week in the league he's actually done quite well that's what most New trainers do. He's definitely at least one horse finishing the money on the flat on the jumps as they get over this second, which is a lot better than most of us did in our first week. And they get over the third. A mistake by Leon Van Rinsburg's keep alive, but it's Ora Ferra who's in the lead from the Shindy Wen back in second, and Code Black and Max. And here and along as they get over the fourth. They're all safely over. No Lecker Marcus is now the back marker. Oh, won a few times last season in pretty low grade company, though. Uh, flying a little bit above his weight today. And it's Aura Fera in front. Oh, you Shindy went second. Code Black third, then Keep Alive fourth. Max is in fifth, and then Ariel along. They're pretty tightly packed with the exception of this leader. Uh, these tight tracks, you don't want them to get too far in front. I guess they can be difficult to catch sometimes as they get over the fifth. Uh, Yossamot just lost its place a little bit as they go past the little building. Then now they'll pass the big screen and the winning post after they've taken that hurdle. Uh, they're all safely over that one. Another circuit they go. And Aura Fera on the inside is in the lead. Keep alive is wide on the track. We must be looking for some nicer ground. I would guess. Code Black is back in third. Then come the Alex Cherry pair. Max and you Shindy went. Be a dancer has got the inside in the purple. The dark blue of Bahamian branch he is next with the one that's a little bit difficult to see. We've just got Obscured a little bit there was Darren Thompson's area along that was now shuffled to the back though as Yossamite and no Lecker Marcus make a forward move. But it's Keep Alive who's now got into the lead as they get over the seventh. Over it in second is Aura Fera and Code Black, then no Lecker Marcus who's now making a forward looking run as they get over the eighth. Well, just three more to take now. No Lecker Marcus has swept through to take it up. It's almost really in Hunters, I think, last season, so. Ooh, the surprise of that one wins. Keep alive and Yossamite are oh, still there though. So too is Aura Fera. Code Black's trying to get into it as well as they get over to the third last. And it's Keep Alive on the inside who's now gone back into the lead. But Yossamite on the outside looks to be going well. No Lecker Marcus isn't giving up. Code Black is there. In comes Aura Fera. Be a dancer. He's beginning to run on. So too's Max. He shindy when looking one pace. The area along hasn't picked up yet. And Bahamian Branch has got work to do. But more than capable of doing it 
as No Lecker Marcus pokes his head back in front again with two to jump. It's No Lecker Marcus in the lead from Yosemite and Keep Alive. Then comes Co Blackbeer, Dancer and Max after that one. They've got two to jump and less than two furlongs to go. And No Lecker Marcus is in the lead, but Keep Alive is coming on the inside. Good jump though by the leader. And No Lecker Marcus in front, but Yosemite looks to have a double handful. Yosemite bursts into the lead, and it's Yosemite that goes on. Yosemite's in front, then racing down to the final fence. Yosemite gets over in the lead. Keep Alive every second. No Lecker Marcus third, but Yosemite is being hard held, and he's still going to take it quite comfortably. Yosemite takes it. No Lecker Marcus a bit racing second. Co Black third, then Keep Alive here, and along was running on Aura Fira. Drop back to last, but run a really good race. And Craig Beckwith is the king of the states at the moment, isn't he? Top US trainer over the jumps, guaranteed version in there. I'm sure we've got many more races after the next one in America this season, so Craig Beckwith may have picked up the first trophy of the season. So Yosemite then, 40 to one shot, takes it nicely. I think that was a newcomer as well. So Yosemite for Craig Beckwith, the winner. No Lecker Marcus for Martin Lynn was second. Code Black, Graham Clutterbuck was third. Keep Alive, Leon Van Rinsburg fourth. And Leon also took fifth with Bohemian Bunch. Remember, that was a hurdle. So those ratings that they've got there are hurdle ratings, not chase ratings.